you kind of do that, you can't get too safe and start, you know, sorry, I don't really like being in the film. I get awfully embarrassed about it. But, um, so it's sort of get you out of your, you know, comfort zone. Because you're obviously drawn to Yeah, working with like a tonal palette. Because I also think it sort of reflects, you know, it's the light of this country. You know, it's a very kind of Northern European thing, you know. And, well, absolutely, and came back a new man, that's mm -hmm. it, you know, with the, the, the Mediterranean dazzle there, Mike, so. <laughs> but it's good to use colours and to try things that don't rest comfortable with them, you know, because I think you could end up just very easy. Yeah, you can, I, I, yeah, you can repeat yourself, and I don't think you should do that. And actually, I, you know, maybe because that's a, a newer piece of work, you always tend to have a fondness for your latest pieces of work. But it's actually nice seeing older pieces of work as well that you sort of forgot about and actually seeing what you think is good in them. And also recognising, you know, what's failed in it. I think it's probably the most important thing. So you can try and do better next time round. You know, that's all you keep hoping for is that the, you know the next new painting sort of goes up a notch, or at least learns from, yeah, the, from, the, from the preceding one. So, 